they were preaching for me. Yeah, I actually saw you on the two too. <laughs> there we go. How you doing? What are you doing down here? Oh, uh, just walking around. Yeah, you were on the tube. I, I remember yeah. you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I just got into London. Today, okay, so. where are you from? Australia. Okay, yeah, your accent, I was listening. I was like, okay, you sound like you're from, I'm Canadian. <laughs> All right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. so how's it, how's it down in us? I'm going to be headed down there soon. Really? Yeah, probably in about maybe three weeks. All right, Three weeks nice. I'm going down there. I, 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 I know it's a big place, so I think I'm mainly going to the two main cities. I think it's Melbourne and I think it's... Sydney. Sydney. Yeah. Is that where are you from? I grew up in Sydney, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. So is that where you're like based out right now? Or? No, I live in Canberra, which is Canberra. like, yeah, it's like three okay. hours from Sydney. So what brings so. you out here? Um, I have been like around Europe for three months okay. doing uh, just like a Euro trip. Oh, okay. Um, nice. And then I'm flying out to Sydney to on Sunday. Okay, so, yeah. okay. Yeah. So you've been like kind of around Europe for a bit. Yeah, yeah. And then I just picked here to fly out of, but I didn't realize how expensive it was. So I'm only here for two nights. Cause, Very expensive. Yeah. yeah but the pounds. You can find some cheap stuff. I had a cheap dinner. So, yeah, there you yeah, go. Yeah, yeah. There you go. It's cool. It's okay. so busy though. It, it, yeah, this is the busy spot. This is yeah. where everybody's at. So yeah. that's why I had to come <laughs> down here and experience it as what well. Are you, so what, what are you doing here? Uh, what I'm sorry, say that what again? are you doing? In oh, London? yeah, um, meeting great people like yourself, <laughs> uh, having great interviews, having yeah. great food, yeah, just you know, exploring and, and, and just helping everybody that I can in any way that I can. So, what's your like, how come you're filming and doing the interviews? And stuff? Um, uh, it was actually kind of random, actually. We were yeah. working on a short film, so okay. and then, uh, yeah, we just out, I, don't, I don't even know. Someone started to ask me questions and then it just turned into <laughs> a random film and then, you know, so, yeah, we do a lot of street dialogues. Today wasn't really in the plan to do street dialogues, but, yeah. but uh, it just, going with the flow, with the flow yeah. you know, so, yeah. And what about you? I mean, you're just exploring and when you, when you go back to yeah. Australia, what, what's your plans there? Well, I have a few months off now because I finished uni. Okay. So, I don't know, I, I have some, like, plan sort of at the end of the year with friends and stuff and then okay. um, next year in February I'm starting work so okay, good yeah, for you. Good just for like you. chilling out till then good for you. Good for yeah you. so if I were to ask you what's one thing that you could leave that would leave a lasting legacy for yourself and also for the next generation like what's one thing you could say one thing that you could inspire somebody or something that you're proud of saying that you can say, you know what, for the next generation, this is what I would say to you. Like, so if you mean... If you had to say something to the, to the next generation, to inspire them to, from where you're at in life right now, what would you say? I think, like, to be optimistic, I think is, like, I think when, when I was sort of a teenager, I was pretty pessimistic and then Coming into like young adulthood, it can be easy to be a pessimist and be sort of down and out about the world, but like it doesn't really help yourself or anyone around you to have that attitude. So I think like even when things seem shit, just like trying to see the good side of things is it's helped me and like it's something that I think that this like next generation is actually really upholding as well. Like they're it's it could be a shitty time for a lot of people but I feel like they have a lot of optimism and, and they're quite an inspiring generation, you know. Like they're right. only a few years below me but I feel like they're gonna do good things. All right. Yeah. All right. Well thank you so much. Yeah, no worries. All right, all the best. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Okay, yeah, you, you take too. care. Yeah. You too, you too. All right, man. Well I guess I mean it's a new form of evangelism. Just take out the camera and uh, people start coming, they wanna be on the camera, so What's going on, man? Okay, he wants to be famous. He will be famous. He'll, he'll get it. He'll get it, man.